Hi everybody, and welcome to another mind-bending episode of MCPHS Screencast Theater. Today we're going to take a look at how to check your schedule online through WebAdvisor. This one's pretty simple, but it's sometimes the simplest of things that are the most important. So listen up and let's get started. The first thing you'll need to do, as always, is get to WebAdvisor and log in. If you're not sure how to do that, then hit pause and check out one of our earlier screencasts. Otherwise, follow me. Now, you may have already noticed that over on the right-hand side of the student's menu, there's a little link that says My Class Schedule. That's just the link you want in order to check your schedule so you can click away. Once you click on the My Class Schedule link, you get to the only kind of complicated part of this whole process. You have to choose which semester's schedule you want to check. Just pick the semester you're interested in from the drop-down menu and hit Submit. And there you go. It's the easiest screencast yet. When you do get to the schedule page, you can see all the different classes that you're registered for in that semester, along with the days, times, and locations of the class meetings in the meeting information column, and even how many credits each class is worth. If you want more information, you can also click the blue links for each class to get a course description and detailed contact information for the instructors. So checking your schedule is easy after all. It's a good thing, too, because you should check your schedule at regular intervals throughout the year. You always want to check your schedule a day or so before classes start to make sure you know where to go on the first day of the semester. You should also be sure to look at your schedule for the upcoming semester at the beginning of the pre-registration period. That way you can check it against your program evaluation to see that you've been batch registered for the right classes. And if you're not registered for the right classes, you'll have plenty of time to meet with an advisor during pre-registration to fix things up. Well, that just about does it for this episode. Stay tuned for more helpful screencasts to come, but until then, stay classy, MCPHS.